Hey everybody, and welcome back. Today we're tackling a common social situation, dealing with disrespect. We've all been there. Maybe it's a rude colleague, a condescending neighbor, or an internet troll who thrives on online negativity. But before you unleash your inner Roman gladiator, let's learn how to be a stoic superhero in the face of disrespect. Lesson one, don't take it personally. Imagine disrespect like a boomerang. It only comes back to hurt you if you catch it. This person's negativity is their emotional baggage, not yours. Lesson two, know your source. Maybe they're having a bad day. Maybe they haven't discovered the life-changing principles of Stoic philosophy yet. Consider the context and try to have a little compassion. Lesson three, choose your battles. Not every gnat needs squashing. Sometimes the best response is no response. Is this disrespect worth getting emotionally fired up over? Pick your moments wisely, Stoic warriors. Lesson four, respond with wit, not wrath, because being clever is cooler. A sharp comeback delivered with a smile can completely disarm a disrespectful foe. Bonus points for using ancient Roman proverbs. I want to thank you all for subscribing, and if you enjoyed this video, go ahead and smash that like button. Lesson 5. Breathe and reflect. Volcanoes don't erupt without warning. Before you react impulsively, take a deep breath and practice mindfulness. Stoicism is all about being mindful and responding thoughtfully, not knee-jerking like a startled donkey. Lesson 6. Focus on what you can control. The remote is in your hand. You can't control how others act, but you can control your own thoughts and actions. Choose to be the bigger person, the Stoic Sensei. Lesson 7. Learn from it. Even disrespect can be a teachable moment. Maybe this is a chance to practice your patience, or to set a clear boundary in your interpersonal relationships. Every experience is a chance to grow as a person. Lesson 8. Forgive and forget. Holding grudges is like drinking poison. Let go of anger and resentment. It only hurts you in the long run be like a stoic phoenix rising above the ashes. Lesson 9. Set boundaries, because stoics don't have time for nonsense. Sometimes you gotta politely remove yourself from a disrespectful situation. It's okay to say no and protect your inner peace through healthy boundaries. Lesson 10. Be the change. Be so stoic they can't help but be inspired. The best way to deal with disrespect is to live a life so virtuous, so calm, so ridiculously awesome that everyone wants to learn more about Stoic philosophy too. So there you have it folks, 10 Stoic lessons to handle disrespect like a total boss. Remember to learn more about Stoic philosophy, like this video, subscribe to the channel, hit that notification bell, and let me know in the comments below what your favorite Stoic principle is.